Hi, welcome to Desi Aroma. I'm going to do a dish called Momo. Uh, in Delhi or in Tibet, Himachal, everybody knows uh, from Nepal what Momos are. These are uh, the Chinese style dumplings, but of course uh, they are the Indian version of those dumplings which are called Momo. Um, so let's get started and see how these Momos are done. Okay, so in goes the pork. Now I'm going to just take, this is about, you know, a little, about a teaspoon of that. I'm going to add my onions and my green onion to it. it kind of gives me an idea how much salt I'm looking at. You know, I'm not a person who does that count of teaspoons and all. I can just look at what I need and just use it. Okay, so that I'm going to use about a tablespoon of soy sauce and a little bit of salt. I'm just, you know, I'm going to maybe just leave another. Okay, so that's all I need. And I'm going to go ahead and mix this up. About a teaspoon of uh, pepper powder in it. So using these uh, wonton wrappers you can find at any Chinese store. Uh, there's like 50 wrappers in a piece, 100. I might be able to make about 75 momos out of that. You take the wrapper and you just wet your finger and wet all sides of your wrapper. Take a spoonful of your filling and set it right in the middle. So a spoonful of that filling goes in the middle and then you start with the corner. So take your wrapper and hold it like this and start from the corner. Pinch your corner up and then put a fold and pinch. Another fold and pinch. At the same time with your finger push this meat down so it's not coming out. So pinch, fold, pinch, push, pinch, push, pinch, push and fold. And as you can see the whole thing is made. And just So here's the steamer we are going to use. It's a double steamer. Uh, I bought it off a Chinese store. You can buy that. Uh, I've got that uh, filled with water about this much and uh, you know the water is heating up. So these are the momos we made. So let's go ahead and set these momos up. So we're going to put the momos in here. Keep some distance while putting these so don't stick them too much with each other. So we'll load half of these on this tray and then we're going to do half on the next one. Then I'm going to set the second tray on that and we're going to add the other half right in there. So that will take the other half. So you got the idea is just put these up in there and close it. Leave it for about 15 minutes this should, uh, the skin should get translucent and that just shows that your momos are done. So once your skin becomes a little transparent, your momos are done. Okay, the momos have been steaming for about 25 minutes. At 15 minutes, I changed uh, the top to the bottom and the bottom to top. So let's open it up and see how it looks. So this is what your momos are looking. You can see they're nice and translucent, you know, this all, almost see through uh, what they have become. And if you look at your second tray, that should look the same. So as you can see, this looks the same. So what it's telling me is that my momos are done. I'm going to turn this off and pull it off my, my gas. Thank you for watching the show again. And if you have any questions regarding the momos, please write to us and will answer you all that and do watch my momo sauce video to see the sauce which goes with this momos thank you